Yes, um, we all bear responsibility for that loss. Every single one of us, every single coach, every single player. Doesn't matter if it was uh, offense, defense, special teams, or coaching. We all could have done a better job to get the win tonight, and we didn't. So we have to uh, figure out why, and we have to push on from there. Questions? Jim, can you evaluate the offensive line? Can you evaluate the offensive lines play? I know Utah came in was one of the better. I can't until I look at the film. No, I mean, I, I know what you're referencing. You're referencing the sacks. Like I've said a lot of times, and I'll say again, and I'll say until the day that I die or I'm involved in football, sacks are a component of all level. Sometimes it's a rush. Sometimes you get beat. Sometimes the quarterback holds it too long. Sometimes guys don't get open. So I think when we look back at that, we'll see that it's a function of all of those things. Were you guys surprised to see so much of Kendall Thompson, um, Wilson, right now for the first series, I think? Well, I mean, it wasn't something that uh, they had shown a lot of. We had a feeling that they were going to play him some, but we didn't know they were going to play him that much. How much, I, and I know you're saying the sacks is a factor of everyone, but how much do you put on Brett, especially? I know he, he ran around a lot, and, and there were a few times, it seems like, where he could have gotten rid of the ball and didn't. Yeah, like I said, you know, it's hard to evaluate those things without looking at the film because, you're, you know, you can't focus your eyes on the entire field. So for me, I'm looking at either the quarterback, the rush, the route, you know, it's, and I know it's a coach's cliche and, it's, and it sounds like a cop-out and it's really not. You have to go back and you have to look at the film and you have to analyze each one, you know, because there's a different reason for every single one. So I'm not trying to skirt the issue. I'm not trying to give you a coach talk or a cop-out. That is the God's honest truth. Did you think about taking another shot downfield at the end there instead of maybe going for that long field goal? With four seconds left. Or with seven seconds left? There was four left. Before that. Or with four seconds left, did you think about taking it? No, because we were trying to win the game with a field goal, because you don't get another shot with four seconds. Yeah, you, you, the play takes more than four seconds. Any more? How different was their offense when Thompson came in versus what you saw with Demis Wilson? Just a little more build, more mobility out to the left. You know, uh, a guy that is, uh, well, I think that the other guy's a good runner, but this guy's a better runner. You know, probably just a, uh, a more agile, faster, you know, probably a little bit more nifty. He's not 6'7", you know, he's just got a little more stuff to him. Doesn't throw the ball quite as well, but he runs the ball well. Paul, uh, Paul Perkins had like 77 yards in the first half, didn't seem to play much in the second. Is he hurt or was it a scheme thing? Uh, he's sick. Coach, what was going through in your head when you got the second attempt for a field goal? Well, I was hoping we'd make it. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I thought that, you know, 50 yards is a, is a makeable kick. So, uh, we've got to make those, you know. We've got to do better. In all, like I said, it's all phases. It's not one play. Unfortunately, it came down to that one play, but there were a lot of plays that led up to that play that we needed to make. All right. Thanks, guys. Thanks, everyone.